The Chinese government has released a blacklist of foreign food and cosmetics companies whose goods and services will be banned from China. And the list includes dozens of Korean companies. Some suspect this is a continuation of the months of economic retaliation China has taken against South Korea for deploying the THAAD missile defense system, which Beijing says is a threat to its security. Kim ji reports. It appears China may be continuing its economic retaliation against Korea for deploying the U.S.-made THAAD missile defense system. Among a total of 655 companies on China's import blacklist released this month were 24 Korean firms. According to the Beijing office of the Korea International Trade Association on Friday, their products are banned for having a record of being previously denied entry by China's customs office and for a high number of reported cases of faulty or unsafe products. This time, the targeting of Korean companies may be more subtle, but on top of China's string of retaliatory measures in recent months, it still stings. In April, the Chinese authorities banned imports of more than 460 items, most of them Korean food and cosmetics goods. And that followed an import ban on more than 80 Korean products in March. Although Korean retail giant Lotte is expected to have been dealt the heaviest blow by the measures, a Korean embassy official in China denied that the latest blacklist has anything to do with the deployment of THAAD. Instead, it pointed the finger at small Korean companies' tendency to ship their products without sufficient preparation, including inappropriate paperwork and problems with packaging and the labeling of ingredients. Kim Jian, Arirang News.